Hi, welcome to Brand Name Art Vlog. I'm Brand Name Arts. What does art mean? What is the artist's duty? A friend once told me that it's an artist's duty to affect social change. I disagree with that. It is an artist's prerogative to affect social change, but duty? No, I believe an artist's duty is to express his or her own particular notions of beauty. I don't necessarily mean flowers on a hill beauty. There are many different kinds of beauty, as many varieties as there are artists, and for that matter, people. Beauty is a broad term. So how do we define beauty? Well, to borrow from Keats, we can define beauty as truth, a personal truth that may or may not be a truth to anyone else. Beauty is subjective, and art, being the expression of beauty, is as well. But beauty is the only thing an artist can rely on. If it is beautiful to the artist, then maybe it is also beautiful to others. But if the artist does not see beauty in their own work, then how can they expect anyone else to? Beauty is truth. And at the end of the day, the artist's own sense of beauty is the only thing they can trust. So, what should art say? Question. Why should art say anything? At least, why should it say something that can be articulated with words? If that's your goal, why not be a writer? As a visual artist, you need to... As a visual artist, you need not be bound by such confines. You can express things that words are inadequate at expressing. Vague feelings, the power of color, sumptuous shapes and lines and contrasts things that work on subconscious levels. Still, some feel compelled to make a point. Points can be made in visual art, and they can be made very well. And they are also extremely difficult to make in visual art. I'm speaking of the static image here, or sculpture. That even the greatest artists are seldom successful at making them in a, in a way that does not require pre prerequisite indoctrination to a set of symbols on the part of the viewer or outright explanation from an expert. If your goal is to communicate an idea, but your work requires verbal explanation to do that, then I think you have failed at that goal. Of course, some attack this problem by, sometimes literally, screaming the point in large print scrawled on their work. This comes off to me as didactic. It is not an elegant or persuasive way to make a point. In fact, if somebody's on the fence about the issue at hand, your screaming at them may well push them over to the other side. So how about this? Beauty first. If the point you are trying to convey does not communicate well, then the beauty you have expressed may. And maybe the viewer will be so taken aback by the beauty that they will actively seek out the message. And if nothing else, failing at making a polemic while succeeding at making a beautiful piece of art, well, that ain't half bad. Personally, I see a lot of problems with setting out to make message art. Not so many that I never attempt it myself on occasion, but I certainly don't make it a condition of my success or failure as an artist. I make beauty that condition.